a Louisiana judge by the name of Michelle Odenet has been suspended by the state Supreme Court after a sickening video of her using the N-word went viral earlier this week. The documents that were file read hereby is the disqualified from exercising judicial functions without salary during the pendency of further proceedings in these matters. This means the Louisiana Supreme Court has officially opened an investigation against the disgraced judge with the possibility of more action to be taken in the future. People across the country have called for Odinette's resignation after a video being played on a home television screen shows surveillance footage of a fleeing suspect apprehended by a homeowner after allegedly breaking into a car on the property. While you can't see any faces in this video, you can hear a male voice saying, and mom's yelling, ninja, ninja, followed by a female voice, allegedly the judge, Odinette, laughing and saying, we have a ninja, it's a ninja, like a roach. A lawyer for Judge Odinette spoke to the Academia advocate about the incident early this week, saying she felt humiliated, embarrassed, and sorry for what she has done and the harm she has caused to the community. But she's a figure or a pillar in the judicial community. And she got caught slipping. And who put the video out is the million dollar question. Whoever put the video out definitely got her caught up because she was amongst her family when they were making the video or saying the things when it was being recorded. It's bad because it just goes to show you that's how people think about people. That's how people think about black people. But then I look at it in another way. Everybody tends to talk they shit when they're in the privacy of their own home or when they're amongst their own people, family members, cousins, and whatnot. Everybody talks their shit about other races, calls them whatever they're going to call them in their privacy. The point of the matter is, if you're some kind of public figure and you get caught saying it on video, it's going to cost you. That's all it really is at the end of the day. Because at the end of the day, most people make racial stereotypes about the other ethnic group. And we know that to be true. When you're among your buddies and y'all talking about white people, y'all calling them backers and every different thing you call them. And when white people are amongst their buddies and they talking about black people, they call them ninjas and everything that they call them. Orientals, Mexicans, all the same. Everybody does their stereotypical talk when they're amongst their own people. But the thing about it is, if you get caught on video doing it and you're some kind of public figure, it's going to cost you. And even if you're not a public figure, if it get caught on video and it goes viral, you could possibly lose your job. It might be hard for you to get another job. And that just that's just for the normal person that's not a public figure. So, hey, you know, saying it and recording yourself or if somebody's recording you is a dangerous game. It could cost you a lot of things. It could cost you monetarily. Yeah, it could uh, hinder you from getting other different positions in life. So we got to be careful with what, when, and where we're saying certain things because it could cost you at the end of the day. And it does cost to be the boss. And with that, I'm going to say this is the news in you. North, east, west, south. Unite from every alley in Cali. Intersection and back street. Subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up on your way out. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not who you think I am. 
Your perception is a lesson with a fail grade on it. Yeah. Steady living life like I would never see the morning. True shit, man, I'm more than pain, I'm more than stain on sidewalk, I'm more than black skin on my face. Destined to be great, gotta elevate mind. Elevation is the game that I gotta play, gotta win, gotta find escape to a better day.